Hi there. Epilogue time. We're done with my sleep after this, thank god. Or are we? It gives me control. Muscle and sinew that once obeyed you now rebels against you. Oh. How you can remain here at all confounds the mind. It's still my heart. You think you can just come in and take over? I'm not gonna sit by and let that happen. Wow, for once Terra not emoting actually works. Yeah. Considering his emotions are in his armor. <laughs> Hand acting! <laughs> You're gonna get shown the door, old man. As I recall, you couldn't even handle your own darkness. How then will you triumph over mine? <laughs> Sorry, this framing. <laughs> it's real good. Oh. So that's how it is, is it? Someone else has set foot in your heart. Ericus, you sly fox. I'm not afraid of what the darkness holds now. Even if you do wrest control of my heart from me. Even if you cast me. Actually, he's actually trying! What? <laughs> he's so inconsistent. One cause that pushes me to keep on fighting. Whatever the cost. Brave words. Oh, he's doing the Alpha Fist. <laughs> Did they record this like years later or something? However, know this. You are just one of many roads that I might choose to take. Ain't that the truth? <laughs> I can nort so many boys. <laughs> I took the uh, the road less norted. <laughs> Terra, there's like 50 of me. Terra, I'm claiming them as dependents. <laughs> I'm gonna get so many tax breaks, Terra. Hey, Mr. Master. Oh, come on, you don't even know your pal? Please tell me the amnesia was just a sick joke. <laughs> this is some cliche. God, I love brag. <laughs> hey, you're not. Terra. Just gotta check. Do you like wall crimes? <laughs> yeah, but the answer to that would be yes for both Xehanort and Terra. Yeah. <laughs> Ice cream. Of course. I, I like that this moron showed up, you know, amnesiac, unconscious, and Ansem the Wise just decided to make him a scientist. <laughs> If you if you pass within like five feet of his like workplace, you just get hired. <laughs> now I don't want to say that calling him Ants of the Wise is a bit of a misnomer, but <laughs> sorry, I can't keep track of all seven Ansoms. Snow White and the Seven Ansoms. God. <laughs> Anyways, I guess we're back here. Yep, time to be sad on postmodernist art beach. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you? Hmm? Why, hello. It's not often I get visitors. Please, call me Aqua. Why Quick reminder. That is not Christopher Lee. <laughs> I was about to ask, because, yeah, that is an incredible impression. Well, I can tell you this is my second time on these shores. Yeah, I would not know that's not him unless you told me. I do not remember who I am or whence I came. He even gets, like, the tones and the way he draws out certain words correct. At least I'm pretty certain this isn't Christopher Lee. Let me check. Because I know at least one of or two of the side games, uh, he's voiced by Corey Burton instead. Unable to escape. You wish to return to your own world? No, he uh, Christopher Lee only played Ants of the Wise in Kingdom Hearts Two and Days. I promise I'd be there for them. 
your friends. I think Corey Burton also played uh, Count Dooku in the Clone Wars cartoon and stuff. So. Oh, okay. Yeah. So he's had a lot of practice. Yeah. True to his friends and kind, this boy travels to many worlds and fights to keep the light safe. Keep the light safe? I've been away too long. Did something happen out there? Are the worlds in danger? Uh, time is weird. Shit is fucked, Aqua. I don't think they ever truly explain it, how time works in, uh, like, the realm of darkness or whatever. Huh? Wait a sec. Because, like, I don't think the implication is supposed to be that Aqua has physically been in here for ten years. Neither of those. But Ants of the Wise is definitely talking about Sora. Should have known. How long has it been since I met him? At least a year now, perhaps more. Back then, my heart was clouded with vengeance. I did terrible things, both to him and his friends. Wait, shit, does this take place after he gets exploded in two? Oh. <laughs> it's Kingdom Hearts timeline time. <laughs> Someone call it BDG. A means of clearing my conscience. Or perhaps out of a sort of scholarly instinct. God, now I'm just thinking about the unraveled bit where BDG sees Vinitas without his mask. It's just like, why is that evil Sora? That's Vinitas. Why? <laughs> I was just thinking of that, that one SpongeBob meme, you know, with uh, Gary in the robe and everything in the dream. Uh, in this one, um, Gary will be labeled people who understand Kingdom Hearts timelines, and SpongeBob will be like, you know, people who understand classic Russian literature. <laughs> so many are still waiting for their new beginning, their birth by sleep. Oh, he said it. He said it. He said the thing. <laughs> What's this boy's name? His name is Chain of Memories. <laughs> <laughs> that is two Kingdom Hearts games in a row that don't have a number in the title where they say the name of the game somewhere in it. Because they also did that in Chain of Memories, I'm pretty sure. I'm glad you cut me off because I was about to yell John Cena there. <laughs> oh boy, it's time to drag Namine's drawings again. <laughs> It brings me no pleasure, but I must do it. <laughs> Are you sure? Sora. She's got it better. She has. Wow, she's shading now. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, it's our boy. Oh, and my daughter's here. Yeah. Who? <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> I was about to recite the fucking I'll kill you speech from Hunt Down the Freeman. <laughs> <laughs> also, our large adult son Axel is there. <laughs> Remember how we just left Ventus sitting on a hard. Yeah. Throne. Yeah, he. That boy, if he ever wakes up, is not gonna have an ass left. <laughs> He's gonna have really long thighs. <laughs> Sora. Getting a little into the weird metaphors here. Yeah. <laughs> I love the idea of everybody just looking at the sky. And just say the word sky. Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty certain Sora's Japanese for sky. It is, yeah. Mm -hmm. so, yeah. <laughs> Why, yes, the sky is still there. Good to know. Sora. Ah, oh, that's, that's touching. <laughs> <laughs> Is 
Is that the Walt Disney W? Maybe. Anyways, I guess it's up to us to save these three numbskulls now. Yeah. <laughs> you, I mean, you know if Sora saves Terra, he's just gonna fuck up again. Like, he will <laughs> immediately get possessed by something else. God, fucking InSync Riku. I forgot about <laughs> this. <laughs> His Jinko jeans. It's so good. F yeah, yeah fucking new metal Riku. Yeah. <laughs> This Riku listens to Stained on a daily basis. <laughs> he Riku looking like the basic like a bassist from Spine Shank. <laughs> Why does your dress need that many zippers? Are we really questioning zippers at this point? Still one of my favorite number of things is, like, people making fun of him for all the zippers and belts, which is exactly why he started going overboard on all the zippers and belts. <laughs> because of them. I will say, from some of his design work in Final Fantasy VII Remake is very good. Yeah. I mean, he was the original designer on uh, Seven, if I remember correctly, too. Oh, I did not know that. Kingdom Hearts, a strand game. <laughs> <laughs> Sora America Strand. <laughs> Sora lying dead on the beach. Sora found dead in Destiny Island. <laughs> so. So if that's Kingdom Hearts 1... Yeah. And this is Zero. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> then who was Fawn? Well, I guess we'll find out. This is some primo Kingdom Hearts bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm extremely sorry. I've, I've got a guest uh, recorder with me. By which I mean my dog just jumped on me. Oh. <laughs> well, these are dogs quieter than mine. Yep. Yeah. Always. Anyway, it's time to go back to the immediate, like, events after the end of the finale. <sighs> and to see how Aqua got to the beach for that some. Bit okay. of a weird choice to show that and then go, here's how it happened. <laughs> mm. I mean, I would have just assumed that she walked there, you know? <laughs> yeah. But no. Oh god, it's a movie from the, like, 2006 to, to uh, now? <laughs> <laughs> it's just a beam of energy in the sky. <laughs> ah, yes, the, uh, the Phase 1 Marvel conundrum. Where's the Inception horn? <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, welcome to Kingdom Hearts 0 0.5. What? <laughs> <laughs> We got a map. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, the secret episode is playable. What? What? <laughs> what is happening? What the hell going on? <laughs> Time for us to just fight a, a trillion heartless shadows and neo shadows i think come on. Come on. Fire. 
Thankfully, uh, we've got, like, a bunch of bullshit on us. Like, we're still using the same loadout we had during the last two episodes. It's just now you actually get to see how these work against enemies that aren't just bosses. You're just fucking that one guy up. <laughs> I love Time Splicer. It is extremely Zawarudo. <laughs> Five or six Aquas come out and just start wailing on this one guy. <laughs> I need I need Heartless to protect um, my uh, uh, to protect my children from the uh, fifty feral Aquas that attack them whenever they leave the house. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so, please keep in mind that this is the first time I've played, or even seen this, uh, while I was recording this part. <laughs> huh. Which is why, uh, after this fight, there's gonna be a little bit of a funny thing that happens, because I just didn't know that you're supposed to jump on these. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, am I supposed to hit it? Or use it? What? <laughs> Uh, maybe if I... Nope. <laughs> okay, there we go. <laughs> that doesn't read well as, like, a bounce pad. Like, no, I don't know how really you're supposed doesn't. to know that. So, a lot of the challenge from the secret episode isn't, like, the enemies themselves. Like, they'll do a shit ton of damage to you. Uh, but they're not, like, they don't have that much health to them. It's just that there's so many of them. Yeah. Mm. It just really spams them at you. Yeah, and, uh, we haven't even seen the most of it yet on that Oh, front. dear. Yeah. That's not the one I meant to hit, but okay. <laughs> anyway, if I went quiet for a moment there, I just want the viewers at home to know my dog tried to shove me off the bed and they immediately farted. <laughs> <laughs> Great. The, the, the shit I have to put up with recording this LP. <laughs> God, I absolutely just love watching the enemies freak out after the stop ends. Yeah. <laughs> and they just get hit by everything. <laughs> Come on! Fire! New tag for this LP, time stop. <laughs> oh wait, we already had that Mickey Mouse, did it? Oh my god. <laughs> uh, this recurring gag is bad. It is. <laughs> by god, we... The rest of them are also bad, and by god, we will not let them die. <laughs> also, if I could ever get this to go off, uh, the finishing of Ghost Drive is really cool for a thing with such a dumb name. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't Ghost Drive a Kamen Rider series? Probably. I was gonna say, I think it's the name of a Japanese, like, porting studio. Yeah. Ah, here we go. Just gonna... <laughs> have it not work correctly because I killed off the last enemy. <laughs> <laughs> so, the Realm of Darkness is a little bit confusing. <laughs> Because we can yeah. only go up here now that we have done the fight down there. Fire! The, does it ever give any variety of the Heartless, or is it just these guys? It is just these guys. <laughs> I assume they didn't want to put in too much effort for a thing they knew nobody would see. Yeah. <laughs> Understandable, honestly. 
because holy shit, the conditions to unlock this are ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, that that is some weird Dark Souls bullshit. <laughs> Like, just oh. extremely difficult, time-consuming, and obtuse. <laughs> Maybe that's why I like Neo more than Dark Souls, because it's, like, just go to a level, do the level. Yeah. <laughs> Have a bad time, because Neo is way more difficult. <laughs> The only um, Souls game I haven't been able to complete is um, Sekiro. Ooh. That is a busted hard game. <laughs> the only one I've beat is Bloodborne. Heal! I completed Bloodborne once, did everything, and then um, I tried playing it again with all the DLC, and I, I cannot get past bosses that I just mauled the first time round. <laughs> I turned 25 and just all my gaming skills rotted. <laughs> yeah, all the Fortnite children are gonna bully me. Shit, I got less than a year and a half left. Yep. Then you'll turn into me. <laughs> Cold, jaded, and British. Yep. <laughs> no, being fair, that, that's very, very cruel. Stin Carol will never have to suffer being British. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God. It's okay, I'm the only one of us that has to suffer the poor existence of being American. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Man, I really wish the Realm of Darkness had more of like an interesting visual look yeah. to it, too. It's yeah. very grey. <laughs> I, I'd like it if it was more like the beach, you know, with weird rock formation stuff going on. Well, I mean, that's what shows up once we get rid of the emergence holes here. <laughs> <laughs> you got gears on the brain. Yeah, I really do. But I mean, am I wrong? <laughs> no. Aqua's got to throw a grenade in there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, I'm just saying, would Zaya not have succeeded if um, Aqua had a Lancer? We can't <laughs> say for sure, but you also can't say it wouldn't have stopped him. Have I, I've mentioned before, right, that like there's a concept art for the first Kingdom Hearts game that has, uh, it, it's Sora, but he's wearing a crown and has a lion tail for some reason, and one of the initial uh, ideas for a weapon was going to be a chainsaw sword. Oh. <laughs> oh wow, that that is Warhammer 40k. I was just imagining a rifle with the Keyblade bayonet. <laughs> <laughs> Keyblade bayonet. No. <laughs> I do like like the architecture in this area. It's yeah. just it's so visually indistinct yeah. in terms of color. Yeah. It's also, very bland, especially considering how colorful the rest of the game is. I mean, I guess same. that might be the point, but Thank God, by the way, that there's still treasure chests in the land of darkness. <laughs> yeah. Don't you dare miss one. I think I might have missed one, but there's no real easy way to tell. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, see, this area is a little more interesting to look at. Yeah. Yeah. This is better. They, they just played around, and what if it was purple? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, the gimmick here is we have to go to all these, like, purple pools on the ground and then get rid of all the Heartless, because oh, then yeah. it'll get rid of that. <laughs> oh yeah, so we're in, uh, Super Mario Sunshine now. Yeah, kinda. <laughs> but instead of having a Flood, we've got a sword. Good. God, I'm just imagining Kingdom Hearts with Flood now. Aqua! <laughs> <laughs> Farewell. Come, Come on. on. Farewell. Come on. <laughs> oh, saying that upset my dog. <laughs> 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 
Really couldn't have recorded more than like two lunge attack lines. Nope. <laughs> nope. Is that one uh, Pros D video? I think these Heartless have got the point. <laughs> <laughs> you would hope. The good news, though, is Time Splicer is very good. It is. <laughs> It's on a two-line loop, too. Yeah. Like, there's no variation or anything. There's no, like, two farewells or two come-ons in a row. <laughs> yes! Anyways, hey, remember when I mentioned Big Hordes? Oh. Wow, they, uh, there were a lot of critters. Oh, you haven't seen anything. Oh no. I feel... I feel fear. <laughs> uh, this fight lasts a bit. Oh no. I kind of realized at some point that, part, like, probably the best strategy is to just fire cartwheel through everything. <laughs> <laughs> oh well, you, uh... You were laying a beat down on them. Yeah. Just absolutely decimated everything that moves. <laughs> Occasionally use Time Splicer. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Come on. It's, uh, oh. it's amazing how much better Aqua is, Aqua is now than Terra was at the beginning. <laughs> when he was the only character that could do damage. I was just gonna keep rolling. Gonna Fred Durst it here. <laughs> That's Rika's job. Am I the first person? To, I I can't be the first person to ever use Fred Durst as a verb. No. <laughs> yeah, like Fred Durst, does uh, Aqua have a Dreamcast? <laughs> no, because I. Uh, all of her movies came out in, like, the 80s. Except for <laughs> Blue and Stitch, I guess. <laughs> but I don't think they have a Dreamcast in space, so... <laughs> I'm so glad I cross AOE attacks. <laughs> also, before somebody, like, goes, Austin, didn't you actually know that Snow White came out in, like, 19... <laughs> I am fully aware that most of the movies in here did not come out in the 80s. <laughs> Anyways, that fight took me, like, more than one or two tries. <laughs> That's why I just kind of spent most of it cartwheeling, because I got tired of trying to do it legitimately. <laughs> It's still... Uh, I'm not showing off any of the actual, like, super bosses, because A, it requires a million years of grinding in the arena, and B, they're all terrible. <laughs> <laughs> One of them is you fight Monstro, and he only shows up for, like, a second, and you have to hit a barrel into him before you can actually do damage. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, one of them you fight against mysterious figure who can't be named yet. Uh, and the fight lasts for a half hour if you are at max damage, because the entire way to do it is to just dodge roll away constantly. He is fully invincible while attacking, and then during, like, the two-second window that he's not attacking, and you can do one or two hits to him, you hit him. And then you continue doing the dodge rolling again. <laughs> it's bad. Also, one of the super bosses is just fighting the armored uh, Zemnis fight, but in Birth by Sleep, and it's also bad. <laughs> oh no, you've got to defeat the uh, Big On Fought meme. Oh, uh, also, this fight sucks. I hate it. This fight <laughs> took me, hell? like, legitimately 45 minutes or so to beat. What is this? 
Oh, uh, you're seeing the, the him charging you through his eyes during that? Predator that, vision. That would theoretically be cool if it wasn't so, you know, distracting and bad. Yeah. And also, like, the slow motion on it uh, makes it really hard, especially if you were in the middle of attacking when it charges you, because then, like, you're just stuck floating in the air, unable to do anything, because you can't block. Yeah. Yeah. Anyways, this fight absolutely sucks ass. Uh, this character or this enemy never gets stunned, uh, hardly ever stops attacking, and will charge you down if you try to move away. So you were just constantly stuck getting your shit kicked in. Oh no! <laughs> yeah, even when he moves, it's an attack. Like, I take this thing down quickly enough, but, again, this took me, like, 45 minutes to do. Anyways, here's phase three. The phase where he jumps away and fires off clones at you. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why this? <laughs> Oh great, uh, he's got ranged attacks now. Fantastic. Yeah, here's black holes. Uh, they explode. Oh my god. Uh, wow. He'll charge at you. He's got like a bunch of clones when he charges. Uh, he's got a bunch more AoE attacks. He's got that big explosion attack now. <laughs> if you do not have once more in second chance, good luck ever finishing this fight. <laughs> As I was say, he just summons the, like, the pink elephant's hallucination from Dumbo and weaponizes it. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna do this when I get to this game. Well, I mean, you would also have to get all the stickers, the Xehanort reports, and beat the game, and depending on what difficulty you're on. You can't do this on beginner, and if you're on standard, good luck fighting 10,000 on first. Catharsis! That boss was bad. That was very bad. The absolute worst in this game's design. Anyways, are you ready for an extreme anticlimax that we're not going to get the answer to for like two years? <laughs> what? Cinderella world here. <laughs> oh god, is this is this what fragmentary passage is? Is yes. this what two point eight is? Yes, Kingdom Hearts 0 0.2 starts immediately 0 .2. after this. <laughs> and we've still got coded and 3D to go through before we see 0 0.2. <laughs> so, uh... <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> the pompous goddamn game. See you next time for oh, Coded! God. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha